Okay, now for question number 10 from the specimen paper um, 2 of the 2020 syllabus. Explain why root 3 is irrational. Now, in, an irrational number is a number that cannot be expressed as a ratio of whole numbers, cannot be expressed as a fraction of integer, numerator, and denominator. Okay, so that's what a, an irrational number is. Okay, so I guess that would be fine for you to say root 3 cannot be expressed as a fraction. Expressed as a fraction, whoops, as a fraction in its simplest terms. In the simplest terms means it has to have integer numerator and denominator. A fraction, okay, in its simplest terms, its simplest form. Okay, because um, root 3 basically is a number, if you've tried to find the square root of 3 and you put the number in your calculator, it's going to give you an answer which continues on and on, and it would continue on without any pattern to it. There's no pattern to the way it continues. Okay, so that's why that happens. It will have 1.732, it will continue on, there won't be a pattern to it. Like if you have, for example, one third, that gives you 0 0.3 recurring, there's a pattern to it. It's just all threes afterwards. Or if you have something like, for example, um, say uh, 2 over 3, that gives you 0 0.6, there's a pattern to it. Okay, numbers like, for example, 0 0.18 recurring like this, that will give you 0 0.181818. And you can express these, all of these can be expressed as fractions. All of these can be expressed as fractions, and, and probably we'll do a question later on in this paper where you have to express the recurring decimal as a fraction, and you'll see. Okay, so any number that cannot be expressed as a fraction of a numerator, integer, and denominator, which is in simplest form, is therefore um, an irrational number. Okay, that's what it means. Irrational means cannot be expressed as a ratio of integers, basically. So if that statement's enough, you could, I guess, also say, okay, um, it continues without any pattern. Uh, the decimal points, con places continue without any pattern. I'm sure they would accept that as well. Okay, so it's just asking for a little explanation worth one mark. So that should be perfectly fine. Next question. It will be next video on the playlist.